Welcome to Freedom Park. We're honored to highlight the many important people, places, and cultures that make Central Texas great. The Texas Longhorn descended from the first cattle brought by Spanish colonists hundreds of years ago. As the Spaniards reached what we now know as Texas in the late 17th century, some of their cattle escaped or were set loose in the wild, where they naturally evolved to adapt to the land. The northern mockingbird is known for its ability to mimic the songs of more than 50 other birds, as well as other sounds like rusty hinges, whistling, and barking dogs. A male mockingbird's mating status is linked to how often he sings, with unmated males singing the most. To help protect itself from larger predators such as coyotes, the Texas horned lizard shoots foul-tasting blood from its eyes, discouraging the predator from further pursuit. In the 1890s, Austin became one of the first electrified cities in the country by using hydroelectricity, powered by one of our earliest dams. Using the kinetic energy of water falling down a turbine, the blades of the turbine spin, powering a generator. The original Montopolis Bridge was opened in 1889 after several years of construction. The height of the bridge floor was intended to be five feet above the highest known flood level at the time. However, it was ultimately built five feet too low, and in 1935, the city experienced one of the worst floods in our region's history, destroying the bridge and leaving an entire community without a reliable connection to Greater Austin. The city worked quickly to rebuild, and in 1938, the new bridge was opened. The Austin Black Senators, a minor league baseball team in the Negro National League, once played at Downs Field, where fans could witness legendary players like Satchel Paige, Smokey Joe Williams, and Austin native Willie Wells. Six Square is Austin's Black Cultural District, dedicated to preserving and celebrating the cultural legacy of the African American community in East Austin. Chicano Park, painted in 1982 by Ramon B. Maldonado Sr. The Chicano Park mural was restored in 2020 by the original creator and a team of local artists with the help of local nonprofit Arte Texas. Thank you for visiting the 183 Trail. Did you know the Mobility Authority has trails throughout Central Texas? Visit mobilityauthority.com to learn more about all of our facilities.